I do not encourage or condone the use of tobacco or cannabis products, and if you're under the age of 18, you can go ahead and get out of here right now. Alrighty, so today I'm going to be smoking a Camel unfiltered cigarette and talking a little bit about whether unfiltered cigarettes are actually more dangerous than normal filtered cigarettes. Now I think without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and get this lit up. I've got, as said, the Camel unfiltered with the tar guard, of course, but I'm going to go ahead and get this lit up and go ahead and get the video started. Let's get it, y'all. Where's my lighter at? There it is. Found it. Now, a lot of people perceive unfiltered to be more dangerous than normal filtered cigarettes, especially non-smokers. A lot of non-smokers believe that unfiltered cigarettes are a lot more dangerous than filtered cigarettes, but the truth of the matter is that they're really not. Now, do they include more risks than normal cigarettes? Yes, they do, but they're not actually really more dangerous than normal cigarettes for a couple of reasons. Um, before filtered cigarettes were created, the most ty common type of lung cancer associated with cigarettes was large particle lung cancer. And afterwards, after filtered cigarettes became more common, it was small particle lung cancer. Now, small particle lung cancer hadn't really existed until this point kind of thing. So basically, filtered cigarettes created a whole new strain of lung cancer, which I find to be pretty amusing because it just hadn't ever really been seen because it was small particle. Most of the time, uh, if you're inhaling something, it's large particles kind of thing. But this was all small particle, which I find to be very interesting. But because of the simple fact, um, a lot of people uh, perceive filtered cigarettes to be a lot more safe when they're not. Uh, they perceive them to be um, safer because it's a smaller particle kind of thing. You're not really getting tobacco in your mouth or anything like that. But as said, the truth of the matter is simply that unfiltered cigarettes are not really any more dangerous than unfiltered or than filtered cigarettes. Unfiltered cigarettes are not any more dangerous than filtered cigarettes. That's the that's the truth kind of thing right there. That's the truth right there. Um, and as said, it's because uh, they, they have two different types of lung cancer, but it's two equally dangerous types of lung cancer. Now, I guess you could argue that because of the extra tar you're getting in your throat, because of your smoking a uh, filtered or an unfiltered cigarette, that is, that is slightly more dangerous. And I agree. I do think it's slightly more dangerous. But I don't think it's any more dangerous to the extent of death kind of thing. I think it's about equal, especially with how much people smoke uh, filtered cigarettes. Now, most of the time when I see somebody smoking an unfiltered cigarette, this is something that people don't smoke on the regular. They smoke it um, every once in a while kind of thing. The only people I've ever met that smoked unfiltered on the regular were people who rolled their own cigarettes. And because of that, even if um, unfiltered were more dangerous, I don't really think we'd see any statistics or anything showing that uh, unfiltered are really actually more dangerous because people just don't really smoke them as consistently anymore. 90% of people have only ever really smoked filtered cigarettes. Even the people I've known for years that have been smoking cigarettes for years don't really smoke unfiltered all that much unless, as said, they smoke Rollies. Um, which I suppose makes sense because unfiltered cigarettes, especially these, are a lot more expensive. For example, these were $8.50. $8.50. And that's a lot of money. That's a lot of money for an unfiltered cigarette. It's a lot of money for a, it's a, lot of money for a cigarette in general kind of thing. Uh, eight fifty dollars is, is a lot where I live. And if you were like in New York City, let's say where a pack of Marlboro Reds cost 13 bucks, this would probably be like 18 bucks, which is absolutely insane. Um, but it makes a lot of sense why people think unfiltered cigarettes are a lot more dangerous than filtered cigarettes in my opinion because for the simple reason that there's a filter. A lot of people think the filter does a lot more than it does when it really doesn't kind of thing. The filter, it really doesn't do much. As said, it just basically makes it where you're not inhaling large particles of tobacco into your throat kind of thing. Whereas with unfiltered cigarettes, you are inhaling uh, large particles of, of tobacco into your throat. Um, it, which I find to be a very interesting thing. I think, I think the whole perception of filtered cigarettes as a safer method of smoking um, is definitely uh, appropriated by uh, smoking companies actually advertising it as such when it is certainly not one of those uh, because that was the original use of the whole filter idea. Filtered cigarettes uh, were originally just something to make people think they were safer, to make people think cigarettes were safer when it really doesn't make cigarettes any safer. It's just all a marketing tactic, which I find to be uh, extremely amusing that a marketing tactic could be taken that far to become the norm kind of thing. Uh, who would have ever thought that unfiltered cigarettes would actually become uh, very much not the norm because of this one marketing tactic that one brand used. It was pretty much all Marlboro who started it as well, which I find very amusing. The, the first cigarette company to really become the biggest in the world um, was the one who really started all of this. It wasn't the first uh, filtered cigarette for sure. Filtered cigarettes had been around since the 40s if I remember correctly, but they were the first ones to really make it popular, which I find to be very amusing. 
from my knowledge at least. Let me put it that way. From my knowledge, they were the first ones to be uh, making them popular, to be making uh, filtered cigarettes more popular. Um, so if you guys know any more information than I do, please let me know in the comments down below. You know what I'm saying? I'm always uh, very willing to look at information and reconsider my opinions and stuff like that um, because I believe growth uh, in opinions is growth as a person. Um, that Maybe that's just me. Maybe that's just me, but that's just how I look at life. You know what I'm saying? Uh, if you don't grow as a person, there's no growth. Uh, then what's to live for kind of thing. You got to have new stuff. You got to have new opinions. You got to have new stuff. You know what I'm saying? So that's what I'm saying at least. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Yes, sir. Man, this cigarette is absolutely fantastic though. I do really, really enjoy uh, these unfiltered cigarettes. They just are absolutely gas kind of thing. They're just gas. And I really do enjoy them. And I just think they're absolutely fantastic. I really cannot complain. It is an absolutely beautiful day out here though. And I... Man, it's just so beautiful out here. It's sunny, blue skies, no clouds in sight, and it's 75 degrees. Oof, oof, it's beautiful, it's beautiful. <sighs> These last couple days have just been some of the best days kind of thing. I don't know what it is about them, but when there's beautiful weather, I'm just in such a much better mood kind of thing. Uh, I, I, I will admit, I will admit, I do be having a little bit of, um, a little bit of, um, seasonal depression kind of thing i will admit when it's like cold outside and i just don't want to go outside as much i will admit it does hit a little bit different kind of thing it's just not that fun but uh when it's nice it's sunny it's it's beautiful out the weather's great it's life is just better to me i don't know what it is but uh that's not what this video is all about but i've pretty much talked about everything i have to talk about about whether unfiltered cigarettes are safer than filtered cigarettes because they're not um or they're not they're not safer they are just as safe or whatever they're this it's equal it's equal they're both just as dangerous as each other kind of thing but uh yeah that's pretty much all i got to talk about so i'm just gonna be chilling for a minute while i finish off this ciggy you know what i'm saying yes sir <sighs> cannot complain in the least really just enjoying this unfiltered cigarettes to me and i understand i'm smoking it with a filter so i will admit it, i am kind of a hypocrite kind of thing um, cause I am smoking an unfiltered cigarette with a filter, but I'll be completely frank. It's not even to stop the tar or stop the taste or anything. This is just to make sure tobacco doesn't get in my mouth. I'll be completely frank with y'all because I know that's part of the experience. I know that's part of the experience of smoking an unfiltered cigarette, but that stuff just be annoying me kind of thing. When stuff be getting in my throat, that stuff just be annoying me. You know what I'm saying? Yes, sir. I think I'm going to take one or two more hits. This is getting a little bit rough kind of thing, uh, which unfiltered, uh, do do that towards the end. Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and take that other hit. Ooh, man, absolutely fantastic. But yeah, thank you very much for watching, guys. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe for more content. I hope you guys have learned something new, and I hope you guys, if you didn't already know uh, about unfiltered cigarettes being just as dangerous or less dangerous, um, or not really less dangerous, but being uh, just equal to normal filtered cigarettes, um, I hope you guys learned something new. You know what I'm saying? Um, but yeah, thank you very much for watching guys. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe for more content Of course, I have my Instagram and my book in the description down below. Highly recommend you guys check both those out Of course and to the next one guys stay safe and peace. Have a great one out there and stay safe yo